All right, y'all. What's up? What's up? What's up? So listen, I want to react to uh, some X comments on the Full Send uh, podcast, and uh, just just a small segment, um, not the whole thing. I just I just really want to dial into the fact that he 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 doesn't think or he's not confident that <clears throat> Drake will recover from this, which I will disagree with. I will straight up disagree with. But let's let's get into it. Moment in time, whatever. But overall, I was still the guy. Mm -hmm. I think that's where Drake probably has to look at it now. Yeah. And Drake will win that, no questions. I think. Don't know. I'm going to be honest with you. Mm. But Drake will always be the bigger artist. No? I'm not going to say that. Really? This is just an interesting time. It's so different than the Jay-Z thing. Right? I'm going to tell you what I think. The entire industry, like, for the most part, they've literally came together. I keep using this phrase. They've came together to see the king get killed. Mm. This is not just we want you to lose a rap. Okay, the we can say the battle's done if you want to. Mm, that's what you're saying. They, they want, want to take him down. They want Drake's reign to stop. Damn. Okay. They're Damn. they're showcased it in every which way. And because of that, I don't know who Drake even hangs with after this. The guys who've aligned, right? Mm-hmm. Metro, we can future they're basically almost showing the internet yeah we're kicking him out the cool table this guy's working he's not in the cool table anymore let's see if they he kicked him out the group chat yeah yeah let's see if he could solo fly if you're that great you solo fly and be number one because we we argue that you've used collectively the culture and each of us to help keep you afloat you do it by yourself and i'm gonna be honest with that thing that's tough because also the the favor of the audience they want to see not only Drake get humbled, but they want to see Drake lose. I meant in terms of catalogs. I think I feel like no oh, matter what Kendrick does for the rest of his life, Drake's catalog, in my opinion, will always be way well, better. But for what I like, well, well, it, it depends on music class, right? You know, I, I, I gave a history lesson uh, when I, I did um Vlad. And I was mm. like, people don't remember the year 2017. 2017 was the first year that Kendrick out commercially performed Drake. He dropped damn, sold 603,000 records. Drake dropped more lives, doing like about over 300 or 400. He was, it was like, at that moment in time, even though Drake was saying that's a playlist, but at that moment in time, commercially, Kendrick was killing. Had song, had songs with Rihanna, Humble. He had a crazy amount of songs. Then he disappeared for five years, right? Mm -hmm. If Kendrick capitalizes off of this, which I, I really don't think they have. So, so, okay, 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 okay. That's, that's more than enough. That's more than enough. So listen, so listen, Here, here's, here's my thoughts. Here's my just straight up thoughts. All right. Here's my straight up thoughts. Right. So when, even, even when you talk about that year, he's like, oh, um, he's like, oh, uh, uh Kendrick outperformed Drake. Technically, no. Technically, no, because when you get into is this thing, there we go. Anyway, uh, it has dynamic lighting, so it'll, 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 it'll fix my shading. Anyway, whatever. So listen, um, I, I feel like with Drake, right, even that year, 2017, right, you got to realize that's on the heels of views. And then before that, you have a few readings too late. And before that, you have nothing else to say. And before that, you have to take care. He had four albums performing at the same damn time. Take care till this day. Till this day. So, stop, stupid alarm. Anyway, to this day, to this day, I... I think, I think it's so, I think it's so this year, like 400 and something K. This year. 400 and something K units. It's one of the most sold albums of this year. Kendrick did not outperform commercially Drake. He didn't. He had his newer stuff. Sure. His newer stuff, yes. But in the grand scheme of things, absolutely not. You got to realize even with that, with more life, right? There's like seven songs on More Life that don't that 
and he ain't got nothing to do with Drake. You got the Skepta song. You got the uh, you got like this other record, and then you got, like there's a couple more, like he's there. That's more so highlighting other people than it is himself. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong. You go look at it. I, I, I might, I might, I'm, it might be only five. It might be five. It might be only five, five records that ain't got nothing to do with Drake. Because I know there's a Skepta one, and then I know there's that other one. Um, but like it's not a and the and 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 also and also it, there's some experiments in there like with the um with the UK sound and all of that. He was actually going into an experimental bag. Damn was act damn damn is Kendrick's most safe body of work outside of Good Kid Man City. And Good Kid Man, Good Kid Man City, I would argue, was um would argue would be a tougher sale than than Damn is. Damn is a commercial album. Period. Period dot. That is a that is a I'm commercially successful today. Put a fork in it. I'm not I'm not downplaying any of the records. I'm not downplaying he didn't have like huge singles. But when you're dealing with the fact that just last year Drake just came off of selling a million first week, you you can so more life sold oh three hundred and something k first week. Okay, and when you have at the same time, when that album drops, you have views still selling units. You got take care still selling units. Nothing was saying still telling units. If you're reading this too late, still telling units. Oh, I forgot what a time to be alive is still selling units. That's a lot of freaking albums. That's a lot of. I challenge somebody before you go argue with me in the comments. You go to Billboard. You go to that year. Okay, you go to that year, go, go a, go a month, whenever damn dropped, go two months out and go look at the billboard top, look at the billboard top 200, top 200, because that's the, that's the one that has the albums on there, top 200, and you'll see what I'm talking about. I, I, there's never been a year, I, I don't think there's ever been a year where an artist period has outperformed drake off catalog we're talking like off catalog like the the weekend has finally got to a place now like uh, as of late to where he's he's like like competing like on spotify but when you as soon as you add in apple music or any other streaming service drake 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 is so far ahead of everybody else the next closest rapper is, I think, like Eminem with like forty eight or forty nine. The next, the next closest like male artist is like it's not even close. Well, no, it's rappers, it's rappers, it's rappers. It's not even close. It's not even close. He's doubling their numbers. The next closest rapper was Eminem. Is Eminem today, currently, like it's cap, it's cap, it's cap. Like that's the only thing I really want to disagree with him on. Um, I, 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 I don't think, I don't think this is, this is gonna be the end of Drake. I mean, you have the song that he's doing with uh Cam Camila Cam Camila, Camila, whatever her name is. Anyway, and and he, the song Ugly, like a leak came out of that. I seen the same excitement on my TL that I normally see. I said, "Oh no!" I was like, "I'm like, it's not done because he 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 just all he has to do, and he knows it himself. He just got to get back in his bag. I think that's why he moved to Houston. I think that's why he moved to Houston. He bought that place in Texas so he can get back in his bag and surround himself with familiars so he can get back in that bag. And he's gonna tap into some old old Drake." On his new shit, he's gonna tap into some old Drake, and and I, I and I think I think he's gonna he's easily gonna win people back over. He's easily gonna and people are like oh he he can't do it without them artists. Like I heard that I was like that's bullshit. That's bullshit too. 
most of Drake's biggest records don't have somebody else. like he. Mo, let me no, let me not say most of his bigger records. I'll say this. I'll say this because they're, they're, I think it's like an even split on big records that are just him. Because you have God's plan, you have Highline Bling, things of that nature, um, and uh, nonstop, you know, things of that nature. And and then you have, you know, what I'm saying you have the uh, the rich baby daddies and the uh, way too sexies and the jump man and and all that. You have those, right? Outside of that, when you look at like just stream records, period, like Drake's top stream records, a lot of those records is going to be just him. Or it's going to be mostly him just carrying the song. Everybody's favorite part is going to be him. I don't think that Drake has an issue here. I, th I think I think he's I think he gets I think he gets an easy W. Easy W. Because people are still going to listen. People, there is not a Drake replacement. There isn't a Drake replacement. And then, and then, and then my final point is, I was looking at some other dudes say, oh, well, Drake ain't dropped nothing conscious. Technically, nobody listened to it, okay? As a fan fan, I know that he, he dropped a record with Snoop Lion, and he was on some conscious shit. But nobody listened to the song. Barely anybody's heard that verse. I think I think on YouTube that mu that music video might have like to this day, till today might only have like five six million views on it. The song I know the song ain't getting streamed. I know it's not because that mess came and went. The Snoop Lion fans came and went. He went right back to Snoop Dogg. And he had Drake on a record. And Drake was talking conscious on that record. Folks wasn't even trying to hear it. Folks wasn't even trying to hear it. You know what? Look, look I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show y'all this. I'm gonna show y'all this. I wanna show y'all this on screen. Snoop. Lion. No guns allowed. Thank you. It dropped 11, this dropped 11 years ago. Look look at this. Look at this. It dropped, let me move myself. It dropped 11 years ago. It has, it has 11 million views. It's getting it, equivalent of a million a year, which most of these views ain't even, ain't are from when it first came out. Because that's how YouTube works. It has 11 million now. Like, hold on. Okay, here, look. This one it hurts. This one it hurts to be gone. Like, I can't, I can't, I can't play more of it because I wouldn't be able to monetize this video. I wouldn't be able to play more of it, but I want to be able to make money. Um, but anyway, y'all check this video out. Y'all check this video out because I, I, I kid you fucking not. He's dropped conscious stuff. You don't want to hear from Drake. This is what it is. Let's just keep it. Let's just call a spade a spade. Y'all don't want to hear this from Drake. I don't. I don't like I go to Drake to have a good time. I go to Kendrick to get my I, I want to change the world back. And that's fucking okay. That's fucking okay. Anyway, y'all y'all have a good one, man. Y'all have a good one. Stop being hypocrites, bro. Stop being hypocrites. Let it go. All right. Drake will recover from this. Uh, Kendrick Kendrick got the greatest stimulus package of all time. He won. He won the war. Let's just call a space, but he won. I mean, he won the battle. Um, you know, what I'm saying I don't know what this war ends up looking like over time. Um, but you know what I'm saying? Let's let, let's not have recency bias and let's just let everything pay out. The battles, the battle's over. Kendrick won, he's on his victory lap. All right. Let's see if let's see if they re-up and go for round two later. We don't know. Stop, let's stop speculating. Let's just enjoy the music. Have a good time. Anyway, I'm about again.
Y'all have a good one. Peace. Subscribe.